everyone welcome back to technon tech tv in this tutorial i will show you how to draw use case diagram for hospital management system so let's start the use case diagram for hospital management system is the visual representation of processes involved in hospital management system it explains the system's supposed structure and behavior so the purpose of our use case diagram in uml is to demonstrate the different ways that a user might interact with the system use case diagram can summarize the details of your system's user and uh, their interactions with the system so to build one we'll use a set of specialized symbols and connectors so the notation for a use case diagram is pretty straightforward let's discuss it one by one so first one is use cases it is horizontally shaped ovals that represent the different uses that a user might have next is actors it is a stick figures that represent the people actually employing the use cases next is associations it is a line between actors and use cases so in a complex diagrams it is important to know which actors are associated with which use cases last is system boundary boxes so basically the rectangular boundary is the system use cases fall inside it and actors will be placed outside it now let's draw use case diagram for hospital management system here first we'll draw system boundary and then we'll write use case name this is mandatory now we are drawing general use case diagram for hospital management system so the general uml use case diagram for hospital management system shows the main function of the system this shows the general processes or function that the system could do that is uh, based on the uh, transaction done by the patient doctor receptionist whether it's a uh, admission or consultation so general use case is the most common application of a use case diagram and specific use case diagram is basically when someone ask you to draw use case for specific functionality of the system and not the whole system uh, diagram so in exam also they can ask you to draw some specific functionality of hospital management system for example they ask you to draw manage patient information and status use case diagram or they can ask you manage hospital rooms information or they can also ask you to draw general hospital management system diagram so let's continue to draw uh, the general use case diagram so here i am adding actor patient so first patient will register him or herself in a system with the help of receptionist so here i am adding receptionist also and our next use case is patient will book an appointment and here i am adding include relationship from book an appointment to patient registration so we use include relation when uh, use case is mandatory and part of the base use case it is represented by a dash arrow in the direction of the included uh, use case with the notation include so here the use case book an appointment includes the use case patient registration so if patient wants to book an appointment then he or she first need to register himself or herself in hospital so next i am adding manage appointment use case so if patient wants to cancel the appointment or change the appointment then they can use manage appointment option so for this i am using extend relation here so we use extend relation when use case is optional and comes after the base use case it is represented by a dash arrow in the direction of the base use case with the notation extend so here cancel and change appointment is optional next is receptionist handle file insurance forms or claims related info next i am adding actor doctor so doctor can view all patients appointment and at the same time receptionist can also view all patients appointment information next doctor can examine the patient 
so after examination he or she will add diagnosis detail and also he or she uh, prescribe medicine and test to patient and also doctor can schedule further medical process so i have added include relationship for all four use cases because without examine the patient doctor cannot add diagnosis or prescribe medicine and test to patient next doctor and receptionist handle patient hospital admission and for patient hospital admission use case i am adding generalization so generalization is a relationship from a child use case to parent use case specifying how a child can specialize all behavior and characteristics described for the parent so patient admission can be of two types it can be outpatient hospital admission or inpatient hospital admission for inpatient hospital admission we have to allot bed to patient next last i am adding discharge patient use case so doctor and receptionist also handle uh, discharge patient use case so this is how you can draw use case diagram on different topics this is just an example you can add various use cases and actors according to you so that's it for this video if you have any doubt comment us below and if you found some value in this video then make sure to subscribe to the channel and give me a thumbs up do share this video with your friends to spread the knowledge and stay tuned for more videos Thank you.